Sam and welcome everybody to Cybertown. Uh, today we're building a, a Cybertown. You know, it says, does what it says on the tin. Let's jump on it. Uh, choose a face and a profile name. Uh, I'm going to go with, well, sort of Cyber Doctor House. Uh, and it's me, Cyber Tom. Welcome, I'm Nora. Because of your service for the Titan Corporation, you've been given the honor to build a city on the newly discovered planet of Vanclaw 4. God, that's a great name. Uh, it can be an important location for us to profit from. I can see you're confused as you don't remember anything or even who you're talking to. Uh, it's Nora Hangover. Wow, do I have a hangover as well? After your candidacy has been selected, you are put to sleep in order to have special software uploaded to your head via a microchip. I will guide you through your first steps, and we'll be sending all the data- Okay, right. Moving on. Ah, what's going on? I'm losing control! Hey, I'm John. Even before they put you to sleep, I upgraded my own program. Okay, right. You won't remember anything. Uh, pretend everything's okay. Uh, right. Uh, what <laughs> do we want to have as a logo? Okay, t two different people are hacking my brain. Uh, we're gonna be Tom Corp. Tom Cork. Cork. Tom Corp. Perfect. And we'll go with the, the blocks. That seems nice. Okay, bam! Uh, we are on v Venclaw 7. Uh, first objective is build ourselves a greenhouse. Uh, which I would love to do. And then hire some workers. Right, do we want it right next to our power plant? I feel like we should probably have a road coming out. Maybe it can come, like, we can have a main street. I don't want a little, little wiggle. Great. Okay, greenhouse. You can come up here, because I don't know if I want you right next to where power is being generated. Okay, drones, go for it. Uh, build me up a storm. Uh, so we've got you coming in. Wow, there's already a lot of traffic here on Venk, 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 Venger Boys. What is my current quest? Excellent. Now your population won't starve. It's time to take care of housing for your population. Uh, because of the advertised conditions on this planet, people must have shelter. If there's not enough places in the residence, people start building barracks, taking up free space near the road. Uh, for the first time, uh, you can build a poor residential. In the future, you can improve the quality of your housing. Build a residential building. Great. Well, poor residential. Why don't we just go standard? Hey, there's already people building crappy houses here. Okay, we need to get building. Uh, okay, they're building barracks, which kind of are just like little shipping containers. It's actually kind of kind of like the vibe. But I want a big sort of mega towers. They're not even that mega, are they? But they are. They are nice. Citizens using as workers in production buildings. They affect the productivity of the building. Without them, some buildings will not work. Uh, they have morale level that is determined by several factors. Do they have a place to live? Do they have anything to eat? Do they have entertainment? Uh, residents arrive at random intervals. Got it. Some buildings can cause air pollution. Okay, not good. The first steps are ready. As I said before, this planet uh, does not have pleasant conditions for life. The level of air pollution exceeds the acceptable norms for human life, but we've taken care of that too. Titan Corporation has provided the latest technology for air purification. The air filter is a small structure which effectively cleans the air. Okay, great. I'm on. I'm on board. Uh, build air filter. Where does this wanna wanna be? Just down here. From all the the smells of the the plants. Uh, resource storage and component storage buildings are used to store resources and components. You know what? I feel like I could have worked that out. Okay, build me up a storm. What have we got? We've got 78 people. Can I... I want to destroy your barracks. Get out of here. And build another residential building. Ooh, Dementium! It's one of the most important resources on this planet. A uh, generator building converts Udementium into energy for the city. Uh, but it's also a very important resource for export. With very little Udamentium left in the stockpiles, you need to find new Udamentium deposits. Man, saying that word a lot. Okay, we've got to find Udamentium. I do want to build more houses, but I'm worried that I'm going to run out of Udamentium. Some there, and some over there. Right, we can do it. We have the technology. Probably don't want people living right next to it, but in turn, it's my own personal 
horrible dystopian town. God, these guys have already built again. And you need workers. Luckily, I've got workers. Uh, have ten. I mean, nothing's built. Then these guys will move in. Because they are just hogging my power. I'm just going to keep smashing their houses. Because I want them to live in my houses. Right, this is all looking pretty nice. Power pills. Great. If you need the power, take power pills. Delicious power pills. From Tomcorp. God, who doesn't want those? Great. Okay, Udamentium. Coming in hot, baby. My citizens are unhappy. I'm so sorry. Great. Now that you don't have to worry about resources, uh, you have to worry about the happiness of your population. Your people will not be able to work well with access to entertainment. I would urge you to build a pub. I would be so into that. Cyber pub. Yeah, roll out of work. Go to cyber pub and then back home. We have information about approaching energy storm. You need to build a force field generator. Force field generator protects buildings from storms. Okay. Uh, building outside the area can be damaged. Okay, I don't want to be damaged. Oh, he's got a pretty good coverage range. Jeez, my pub got struck by lightning. The city's looking nice already. Like, we've got brightly lit up highways. Loads of people living in here. Extraction of resources is the main task on this planet. Uh, there are many different resources. Your next task is to build a regent mine. Uh, to find the resources on the map, you'll need to find the layers menu. Okay. Mines have air pollution. Right, I'm on it. Do not worry. Okay, where is Regent? Oh, I already built here. How much relocation can we actually get away with? Oh, we can get a couple of them in here. What is the optimum tessellation? Yeah. Mine all that Regent. Show me the money. And... Hit the Blade Gym. Oh, man. Blade Gym. Sounds perfect. Right, at the moment, per turn, one turns into a hundred. So now we can use ten to turn into five hundred. You guys want something? I feel like there should be a button that just takes that to max. I'm not going to lie. Turn it on. Uh, because I just want to fill these things up. Okay, that might be that might be too many. Let's just turn that off. We need more people! The extraction of resources uh, we need is established. It's time to take care of new residents stay and establish transportation communication with Titan Corporation. Wow. Uh, new workers are definitely needed for the growth and development of the city. And fulfillment of contracts for the corporation will enable the construct of new buildings and the extraction of new resources. The task is to build a trade center. Oh, he's a big, he's a big fella. Okay, I'm going to do another reshuffle because um, I can... Slam the pub in here. How are we doing on... Oh, I'm definitely going to have a little bit too much toxicity going on. For, like, theme, I want it to be kind of opposite my main place. Or directly behind. But then I need more shields. Can I build an extra shield? I hope there's not going to be a problem being kind of between the two. Want to trade? There we go. New citizens. Uh, once in a while, uh, a new apartment will arrive. The number of new residents will depend on vacancies in that apartment building. Okay. Got it. I have good news for you. We've been offered our first export contract. You need to export Regent. Uh, it can be found on the outskirts of the city. For this contract, you'll receive uh, the city's development money. Over time, the contracts will become more lucrative. Okay. Heads of the corporations want you to make sure I'm reliable. Yeah, I'm reliable. Okay, well, more people are going to be moving in sometime soon. So let's just get some more buildings. Uh, okay, i got to get contracts. This is region. Rocks. I accept. Uh, do we just want to accept regent contracts? Export 64. Okay. Export 97. Great, I'm on it. So my active ones... If I deposit, great. This one, deposit. Look at us completing contracts. Okay, we sold some of our stuff. This guy's just kind of like producing away. They're all making regent for me. Oh, look, the spaceship is here. Nice, so when anyone kind of lands, they can instantly just go and have a house. What do the crummy houses look like? Oh, they're still pretty big. I guess like maybe we can get some of those just a bit further out now. I left this little gap, not by accident, 
because I'm some kind of cyber dummy. I left it on purpose because I'm some kind of cyber genius. Here, have three of them. I'm worried that we're actually spending cash very quickly. Uh, oh, we exported all of our region. Uh, component storage. Congratulations. You managed to complete your first export contract. Uh, Titan Corporation has high hopes for this planet. And for you. The next step in the city's development will be the production of components. First, we need to take care of reliable storage facilities. Build component storage. Great, I'm on. I'm on it. Deposit. You. Deposit. This one. Oh, that has to be done multiple times. Heck, I just sent all of my region. But we got a load of cash money. We were going to build a component storage. Which I guess can just be up here. We're probably going to be building a module factory at some point. Do we just another component storage? Because then we can make this nice little block. Block of factories and stuff. A module factory. We use raw materials. Not only for export, but also the production of components. Components created from processing of raw materials. A module component crafted from udamentium and regent in the module factory. Okay. Build a module. Yeah, I'm on it. Don't worry. I'm, I'm one step ahead of you. My programming is great. Right, where was that other udamentium? Out there. Oh, it's not there as well. 14 citizens arrived in my city. Luckily, I've got plenty of housing. It's so one thing you can all say for old Tom Corp. Very good at providing houses for people. That looks pretty good. Nice. And do we start just expanding up to get you in our life as well? Just get resource storage out here as well. I'd like to be able to store more stuff. Oxygen is looking great. Producer pollution clear 60. Max pollution 40. Great. People are not mega happy. I might need to get more pubs, because at the moment everyone is sharing the same the same place. Oh, radio station. Do you have a radio station? That'd be cool. You can listen to uh, Tom FM. Great. Okay, something like that. Now, do we want the pubs kind of spread out, or do we want to create like a bit of a nightlife district over here? Oh, it's looking good. Man, I just absolutely love... A bit of like a, you know, cyberpunk aesthetic. Big buildings, neon lights. It's one of my favorite, favorite kind of visuals ever. Join us on Titan. Juicy. Great power shot. Lovely. Oh, it's giving me a lot of money. That's 14 grand right there. 14 Tom bucks. Which is 200 modules. We are good on module production. Three of each goes into that. We can maybe even expand that out and get more people there. Oh. What do they say? I, I, like, got startled, clicked, and that happened to be on the exact right spot to press OK. Right, uh, what are we doing? Complete contracts. Quest. Now you know everything you need to develop the city. Uh, you'll receive old contracts and extra contracts from the corporation. Complete contracts. Complete 30 contracts. I was already kind of on that, baby. Let's do this. Right, let's just take any of the one-time offers that we can. Just deposit. That's three contracts completed. And do you count? Oh, it does count. Bing, 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 bing. Great, that was like 11. 11 done real fast. Uh, what I might do is relocate these buildings. So I want to redesign my road network a little bit. Purely just for goofy aesthetics. But we're going to do a cool road system like this. And then that can come down. And what I kind of want to do is move my radio station to be opposite. Because I want, like, you know, this building feels pretty important and I want old Tom Corp to be really really keeping an eye on it. Do we even care about... I don't think we even want the poor residential. I don't really see what the boon is there. 10 energy, you get 20 residents, but a regular place. 20 energy, you get 50 residents. They just seem... they just seem bad. You know what? They're destroyed. Uh, everyone come and live in actual good, nice, big houses. Yeah, they were just getting sad in the other places. Morale is really high now that we got rid of 
just the bad, the bad houses. Any other things asking for components that are just regular deals? Yeah, any of the stuff that is like one time, I'll happily do. Like someone's like, oh, I need to host a ball and I need a load of regent there for it. I want to give it out in goodie bags. I'm like, don't worry, I've got you. And they're like, don't worry, I, I won't be back. I only need it once. I'm like, okay, yeah, that's why. That's why we're doing business right now. Please, get off my planet. Oh, food. What? Oh, jeez. Consumption? 160 and I'm producing 50? Did I literally just catch that in time? Or have people been starving forever? Okay, let's make the greenhouse district. As... That appears to have been a bit of a... A bit of a problem. 145. Wow, we really need more greenhouses here. God, why are people eating so much? Of my disgusting, like, nutri base. Oh, cyber farm. What is the difference between a greenhouse and a cyber farm? I don't know, but I think we'll have a lot of fun finding out. I'll just do that four times. Congratulations! You made such an impression on the Titan Corporation, but it's only the beginning. Titan Corporation grants you permission for the development of this city under your leadership. New residents will arrive soon, as there are vacancies in departments. Developing a city is very important. You need to develop a city to 200 people and 80% of the people's confidence. Yeah, well, they're already pretty happy. We're already at 160, so not a big problem. 10, you get 45. These farms are just bad. Wow, okay, greenhouse. Greenhouse is just better, but I guess it's bigger. Hmm. Space is not a major concern, so... Uh, actually, let's bin that. Ooh, what an interesting road. Oh, okay, sure. Uh, the demo version's over. Uh, we hit those 200 people. Super well prepared. Just smashing up greenhouses and things like that. Uh, bam, so that's been Cybertown, everybody. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, you can check out the demo yourself on Steam right now, so if you like the look of it, go and, go and give it a go. Uh, yeah, I'm excited to see see where this game goes and like you know what the stuff that you can unlock is. Uh, was a lot of a lot of fun to play. Uh, until next time, everybody. See ya.